Is today the day? Is today the day we pull out Modern Warfare 2 and put it into my Xbox One? We're gonna see here, dudes. <laughs> I couldn't get the disc out of the freaking thing. Alright. Is there anything in here? Yep. I'm playing some Call of Duty 4 a couple days ago. Play some Modern Warfare 2 on the Xbox One. Here we go, baby! Here we go! Hey, are you gonna start installing now? Xbox One? We can do that? Let me guess, the disc isn't readable, and uh... Okay, we're doing it, boys. We're installing some Modern Warfare 2 on the Xbox One, yes! What's up, guys? My name's Delio, and today we're back with a Modern Warfare 2 video because Modern Warfare 2 is officially backwards compatible on the Xbox One. So here we freaking go. And I actually have no idea how this is gonna be because apparently, according to a lot of people right now, the game is actually experiencing some like network problems and it's, like having a hard time actually connecting to the lobby. So we're gonna have to figure that out. So team deathmatch. I guess we're playing Karachi. First off, I wanna start by saying like, obviously you guys know that my first Call of Duty wasn't Modern Warfare 2, it was actually Black Ops 1 when it comes to multiplayer. I never really played multiplayer when during World at War, that was my Zombies era. And I guess you could say my Zombies era is still here, um, but not necessarily uh, as big as it used to be, I guess. Well, it is still pretty big, you know, I'm actually really hyped for Black Ops 4 Zombies, so I hope that it's gonna be good, at least, you know. I know that Trag does not, you know, fail when it comes to creating games and stuff like that, so... Personally, I just think that the game's gonna be pretty freaking good. Can't wait to not even get any kills whatsoever and not be able to do anything. I can't snipe with the, to save my life with the controller. Even on Modern Warfare 2. I don't know what it's been, you know, about me and playing console games, you know, but I've never gotten good at sniping. Doesn't matter what. But I've gotten pretty good when it comes to mobile games and stuff like that, which is really odd because for some reason I'm always really good at that, but, you know... It's 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 a weird thing. It's a really weird thing. You expect a mobile game to be harder than using a joystick and whatnot, but in fact that is incorrect, my good friend. This guy seems like he wants to get a nuke here, so try hard show off hacker. I can't aim to save my life. I should probably turn up my sense, honestly, because my sense is kind of low. And I tend to play better with snipers on higher sensitivity. It's kind of a weird thing, though, because you'd expect, like yourself to do way better when it comes to you know sniping and stuff like that if you're actually like using a lower sensitivity but in fact uh of course so of course it's always those moments when you think you're gonna hit something which i wasn't gonna hit anything in general but i mean it's worth a try i guess go i hope we're able to play some terminal soon because I really don't want to play on this all the time. Freaking Karachi with this horrible freaking connection. I don't I don't want to deal with that. So I want to basically talk about the past few days when it comes to my channel. Because something I've noticed, uh, I seem to have gained a hater. <laughs> a single hater. It seems like I've been able to gain one of those. I'm pretty sure I know who it is, but you know. He's a guy I usually argue with a lot on Twitter. With because he's kind of a jerk for no reason. And I'm using painkiller and I'm actually a disgusting human being. For some reason, I just always get into arguments with him on Twitter because he's just, he's a plain out rude dude. I didn't do anything to him. It just, it gets really annoying when people treat you like crap for no reason. Man, it just, like, it's not even the fact that I actually do bad with snipers. It's just the fact that I can't hit close and the connection is just poor. That's the thing that sucks with these older games and stuff like that. The 360 connection is always freaking trash and I'm not playing a state. Screw that. Personally, I don't understand like why the 360 connection was so bad. But then again, it is peer-to-peer -peer connection and uh, I'm sick of this joystick, dude. Oh my gosh. That's why I want to move to PC. We're about to play some freaking terminal and let's freaking go, boys. So yeah, like I said, I, I this, this is the reason why I'm moving to PC. I don't want to deal with broke well, of course that would happen. You know, it's, it's what a freaking surprise because there's so many people. I don't, I don't want to play that. Stop controller. I swear Xbox One controllers are so cheaply made. I swear to you. Even the new Xbox One X controllers, they're freaking trash. And we're playing some Fabella. <gasps> Dab. I, I'm dabbing ironically. Like, come on, dude. Like, I'm not, I'm not that cancerous, if you could say, in 2018.
You're freaking skilled, dude. Honestly, I don't even understand why that still irritates me because it's kind of just something to expect with this game. There's actually, you know, people in this current year who run Commando and Danger Close and stuff like that. In this current freaking year, in this current year, imagine. No, no, I'm not dealing with that. I wanted to play Terminal, but you know, the lobby is just like, no, it's just not gonna. Same freaking lobby. It's backwards compatible. Why you put me in the same freaking lobby? Like, I'm gonna be completely honest. I don't want to deal with players like this. And, uh, holy crap, the UMP is just as powerful as it always was. I just hope that when MW2 gets remastered that they do change new tubes and stuff like that because I'm gonna be honest, I don't want a full-blown Modern Warfare 2 experience all over again. I like the basic mechanics of Modern Warfare 2 with the tactical nuke and things of that nature and the and different perks and stuff like that, but I'm not a fan of the uh, so-called, um, painkiller and uh, noob tubes and uh, one man army danger close and uh, you know stuff like that because uh... why what is your problem I should just stop raging at this dude why do I continue but still though it's just it gets so annoying man gosh why this current year <laughs> <laughs> okay guys okay so I'm a sweaty nerd so you know what I'm just gonna uh, you know play Modern Warfare 2 really sweatily, and uh, I will not get angry whatsoever, and I'll just talk with his voice the whole entire time, because I actually really love this voice. <laughs> so anyways, what we're gonna do here is gonna go to, to, to the top of this, go up here, and uh, basically, uh, what we're gonna do, we're gonna be getting a lot of different, uh, cool, really, really cool, uh, things going on here, and it's gonna single me out. Yep, uh-huh, I should have just expected that. Hmm, I can't play Modern Warfare 2 today. Screw this. This is cancer. It's just gonna get me into the same lobby. So anyways guys, if you somehow enjoy this ridiculous video, make sure to drop a like and I'll see you guys later. Bye, have a beautiful time.